Okay, welcome back. So your your uh, table should look something like this. When it was zero grams, it was 25 and 7 eighths, 23 grams, and so on. Um, now well, we're going to plot the points. Um, what I come up with, and if I were to graph this as zero and one and two, it would it would make it not fit on the graph, right? So I have to do something to make it work out right. And since these values, it only goes from 25 to 28. If I said 25, 26, 27, 28, it would only, all the values would fall in this range uh, between those two lines. So I'm going to actually uh, cut cut the graph at this point, so that 0, and then I'm going to start it right here at 25. And instead of going by 1 each time, I'm going to go by a half. That way it kind of spreads out the graph a little bit and uh, makes it look a little bit better to the eye. So I'll make this 25, this will be 25 and a half, 26, uh, 26 and a half, 27, 27 and a half, 28, 28 and a half, and 29. Um, okay, and then across this axis, let's see, it goes to 138, so if I did it by tens, it would be uh, not long enough, I think. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So 50, 100. Yeah, I think it wouldn't work. So let's go um, maybe 12s, right? So this would be 60, 120. That would be enough, I think. Let's just try it. So, okay, so 12, 24, 36. 48, 60, 72, uh, 84, 96, 108, uh, 120, 132, and 144. Yeah, that works out pretty well. Okay, and this is zero. So my first point is going to be 0, 25, and 7 eighths. So 0 and then 25 and 1 eighth less than 26. So that would be my point right there. And next is 23, 26 and a half. So 26 and a half is this line right here. And then 23 is just a little bit before that line. Okay. Uh, 46 and 27, so 46 is a little less than 48, and 27 even is that line right there, so it's going to be on that line, just a little bit less than 48. All right, 69, 27, and 7 16, so 69 somewhere in here, and then 27 and 7 16, which is a little less than a half. So we'll see right there. All right, uh, 92, 27, 15, 16. That's pretty much 28. So 92 is somewhere around here, pretty close to 28. Okay, and 115, 28, and 3 eighths. 115 is between these two, and then 28 and 3 eighths. This is 28 and a half, so it's a little less than that, about an eighth less. Okay, and 30, 138 and 28 and 7 eighths, which is close to 29. So 138 is between here and close to 29. So we'll see right there. Now you can see that this makes almost a straight line. It looks like it kind of fades off a little bit, but in general it's it's a pretty linear graph um, looking like a straight line right there and it looks like each time it's going up by about a half an inch here it's a little more than a half inch here it's pretty much exactly a half inch there 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 and there it looks like it's going up by about a half an inch um, for each uh, group that I came up with okay